We had a patient come to clinic recently that was diagnosed with a small brain tumor. And on the imaging studies, the brain tumor looks like a meningioma. So I want to talk a little bit about what a meningioma is and when it would be appropriate to do surgery for a meningioma. The patient I'm referencing had a family history of brain cancer. One thing to know about a meningioma, it is typically not cancerous. Most meningiomas are benign tumors. They're just a growth in the brain. The brain has a covering called the dura. The spinal cord also has the same covering. And the meningioma is a growth arising from the dura. Meningiomas are typically very slow growing and cause symptoms when they get a little bit large in size and put pressure on the surrounding neural structures. In some cases, the meningioma can start to invade the area around where it's growing and cause swelling. And that is a sign that the, the tumor probably should be removed. Most meningiomas can be safely watched when they are small. This particular patient was young and the tumor was very small. My recommendation in this case was to monitor the growth of the tumor with periodic MRI scans. If the tumor were to get a little bit larger, then we would probably recommend removing it because at a young age, the tumor would likely lead to problems in the future and they're easier to remove when they're small. Some patients are very worried about having a tumor in their head or in their spine and that is totally reasonable. Occasionally tumors like a meningioma are removed for peace of mind because then we can also obtain a definitive diagnosis with removal of the tumor. Another comment about meningiomas is we can usually make a very accurate diagnosis off of the MRI scan. Most of the time the meningioma has a characteristic appearance and looking at the tumor we can say that is most likely a meningioma and then we can follow the tumor with additional MRI scans over time to confirm that it's not growing quickly. If you are diagnosed with the meningioma, then if it's causing symptoms or is large in size or is causing surrounding swelling, that would be a situation where a removal of the meningioma would likely be indicated. If, if the tumor is small and a patient is older or it's small um, and not demonstrating growth in a younger patient, then we would recommend not removing the tumor because it probably isn't causing any problems.